Welcome into Ask a Bronco. I'm Matt Boyer, joined by Deshaun Hamilton. Deshaun, we've got some Deshaun specific questions. You ready to go? Yeah. All right, here we go. First one Who is your favorite all time player? That's from Ryan Jam. Favorite all time player, probably Randy Moss. Why my, Now, why Moss? Because, I mean, that's a lot of guys' favorite player. Yeah, uh, Randy, I mean, I was young when I first started getting into football, and the receiver was my first position. And back at that age, watching you know, NFL football, like back in, I started playing when I was like five or six. So Randy Moss at the top of his game back then, and that's a guy I just automatically attracted to. Were you a Vikings fan because of that, or were you are you more uh, DC Redskins, uh, Ravens? When I was growing up, I wasn't a fan of nobody. I was a big player person. I had everybody's jersey. I had like it says it was contradicting. I had like a Brett Favre jersey, I had a Marshall Falk jersey back then, I had a Randy Moss jersey, I had all kinds of people's jersey. I just loved players back in the day. All right, player first. I like it. Next up, what's it like having a wide receivers group primarily of young players? I know. With E going down especially, it's you, it's Cortland, it's Tim. How do you guys take on more of a leadership role as young guys? Uh, we just really just self-govern ourselves. Um, we didn't, we're just obviously pushing each other, and we're growing and learning at the same rate as one another. Uh, obviously just becoming starters and, and becoming more and more involved in game plans and really just getting our feet wet all at the same time. Obviously, Cortland had a head start on, on Tim and I, but um, really just we had been self-governing ourselves, been pushing each other as individuals and pushing each other as a collective group all season. And then, you know, with E being a leader in our room, he's obviously been the one to, to keep us working hard. So we just kept that same mentality he established. I like it, the young guns. Next up, how did it feel when you got drafted? That's from Ryan Stanley. I know draft day is a big day for everyone. What was it like for you? Uh, yeah, draft day was really fun. It was nerve wracking, it was exciting. It's a whole bunch of mix of emotions. Um, but finally when I got drafted, I was relieved. Um, and I was finally just glad I was finally off the board. Starting, starting to feel like you sitting there for a while. but. Um, yeah, when I got drafted, it was just a blessing, and I was really excited for it. Last one, how did it feel when you scored your first ever touchdown? Now, I know that's a big moment for a lot of guys. Did you do anything with the ball? Did you keep any mementos? Uh, see, people are going to learn about me. I'm kind of boring. <laughs> I, I, I forgot the ball. Um, yeah, I forgot the ball. I dropped it right then and there. Um, when I scored it, I, I don't know, I was just sitting there. And, uh, well, I was in the heat in the moment of the game. We lost. Um, we were losing. But um, so I didn't really think anything of it. I was happy, obviously, but yeah, I didn't have too much emotions from it. <laughs> do you now? Do you have to save a picture? Like, what is there anything that you can keep? Uh, the, like I said, the cleats. I, I, remember, I always remember the cleats. The, those are the, the, the my cause cleats, right? Yeah, the my cause cleats. Wearing those cleats in honor of my mama. Um, and then that being my first touchdown, so I could probably do something. I could definitely do something with that. I obviously, we want the ball. I keep the gloves, stuff like that. But yeah, that, those are two things I got. Broncos country, give him a pass. He's gonna keep the cleats. Didn't remember the ball, but the next. Next one, I'm sure he'll remember. For Deshaun, I'm Matt. This is it for Ask a Bronco, but if you want to get your questions in, we'll leave the link below. We'll also put the shout out on Twitter next week, and we will see you next time.